number four and going to the playoff to face Clemson will be... Here we go. You guys, welcome back to another video, and today, well, instead of doing just like the whole catch and cook, we're just gonna do like the in and then the cook. I guess the in is like there for clean, maybe? I don't, I don't know, catch and cook, but you gotta clean the fish first. So this was supposed to be a catfish catch and cook, guys, but, well, that did not turn out so well, as I did leave out a, uh, well, two lines yesterday, and I checked them early this morning, had a catfish on one, came home today after school, catfish was going out of the bin, yes, I know, I'm an idiot. But I've already caught, um, some bluegill, you guys, you guys have seen a lot of bluegill fishing lately on my channel, so I wasn't gonna board you guys out with that, so I went ahead and caught just a few blue, a couple of them, just... Two big ones, just enough to kind of show you guys exactly how to do it. Some of you are, may already know how to, you know, clean and then cook the fish and all that, but I'm going to show you guys step by step today. I have already done two catch and cooks on my channel, but I really never showed, like, the actual cleaning part process and then the actual, like, cooking process, so we're going to do all that today. And while I was at it, I caught one other smaller bluegill, so we're going to cut him in half and set him all out on uh, both two lines tonight. And, well, we're going to see if I can get a catfish on one of them lines again. And, well, we'll do a catfish catch and cook in the next video. And I'll go through that process of catching and cooking and cleaning a catfish and all that. But today, we're going to do bluegill. Oh, wait a minute. Something happened over the weekend. Check it out. So, we'll see. Number four and going to the playoff to face Clemson will be... Yes! Let's go! Yes! Let's go! Yeah, guys, Alabama got in the playoffs. Like I said, one of the top four teams, they lost, and that bumped Alabama right in to the playoffs. Make sure you guys stay tuned to the end of this video because I will be doing another fish picture in this video. I have not done it in a while. I haven't even, you know, posted a video in a while, but I'm back at it, guys. I'm going to be, uh, I'm trying to upload at least two or three videos out there this week, and then, of course, the weekend. And either the next video or the next video will be a video on something you guys don't really know about me. And it pertains to fishing a little bit i guess you could say it has some similarities i guess but it it's different from fishing but you guys will see that in another video to come so now let's go ahead and get right into this catch and cook we'll pretty much clean and cook now yeah so we got our, our bluegills heads chopped off now so first of course what you have to do is you got to scale them just like that So we got our bluegill scaled up now, just like that, bam. All right, so now what you're gonna do is basically, we're gonna um, chop the fins off when we get the filet all done and nice. And uh, so we'll do that at the end. But if you guys can see that right there, that is our meat, all that white right there. That's our meat, okay. Guys, that's just nerves in case you're wondering, like they're, they're not alive guys, it's, it's just nerves. So let's go ahead and try to, uh, well, filet this bluegill up. All right, guys, so bound there's one fillet. I'm gonna get the other fillet, wool fillets, and I'll see you guys then. Fillets right here, as you guys can see, just like that. Bang. Then we come right up here and we have our corn oil in the pot. We have that on high, so we're letting that, you know, heat up once it starts, like, frying everything and, you know, bubbling real well. Then we'll put our fillets in there and, yeah. All right, guys, so we have our cornmeal and flour mix right there. Just going to take a little, little bit of fillet, dump it in there, bam, just like that. Going to get all of them uh, floured up like this. Alright guys, so here is our bluegill right here, as you guys can see, just like always, it's finished. I just got a little ketchup right there. Alright, here we go. And like always, it's just as good and delicious. Man, that's just some good bluegill. Mmm, delicious. Guys, I'm going to finish up eating this delicious bluegill. I'm also going to go ahead and put the fish pitcher right here. Guys, like always, if you know what that fish is, comment right now down in the comments, and you'll get a shout out in the next video. So I hope you guys learned something from this video. If you liked it, please make sure you leave it a thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe if you have not, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace. Scooch. Strong talk.